You're being very moody. Good morning, people. How is it going? It is another beautiful day here in Clearwater, and we are up because we are headed to Honeymoon Island. That is right. It's no one's honeymoon here today, but we're going to be going there. It's a fantastic beach. We're going to be relaxing, chilling, hopefully snorkeling, James. Maybe. Snorkeling. Now, I've, I think I've made him afraid of sharks now. Yeah. James said to me, he was like, are there any starfish in there? I said, well, there might be. Why? Because I, I really don't like them. I was like, they don't even move. He's like, Oh right, okay, I didn't know that. I think it was because a guy threw a starfish at James while we are in Croatia and now he's scared of stuff. <laughs> anyway, let's go to the beach. Yeah, he threw it in my face. Sponge he threw it in your face? He threw the starfish in my face and it's my It's not Spongebob, it's Patrick, Mum. Spongebob's a sponge. Yeah. Oh, it's Patrick. Oh, Patrick. <laughs> right, James, we're in rattlesnake territory, oh, so be I'm careful. I'm defending You'll hear a big old... Like a rat. I don't think so. Oh, it <laughs> it kind of like sounded a like a motorbike, but. I thought it sounded like a baby rattle to me, like. No, it sounds like a. <laughs> like a it's big like a old little... rattle. Yeah. Right, so we're here on the island at the moment. We're just waiting to get the ferry Did over to the. You? Who? What, the, the captain? Snakes. No. Uh... What do they do? They bite you then? Yeah, they'll bite you. Do they kill you? Maybe, if they're venomous well, enough, they yeah. They take you and eat you and give you, like, really Well, I don't think they, they get like, much drag. meat on you, but they might for me. Oh, the swampy waters, James. I'm not going Shark I'm not territory. Going crocodile. Crocod Mate, you've got to go no, in the I'm sea not, with me. I'm Come on. Sea, no. Dude, you have no, to. You see stingrays and I don't like no, you don't. Wait, are we just going over there? Yeah, probably. We could swim over there. We're getting on the little taxi to the island. I think it is that island, but maybe, maybe we're wrong. Maybe it's further away. And we're off. We're going to the island. Wait, what are you munching? <laughs> the little squirrel's got Domino, do, not Domino's, Doritos in his bag. Look at this, woo! We're off. Okay, we're not going to that island then. We've arrived. Wow. It's at the Jurassic time. And here we are. We have arrived on Caladesi Island. And these are all the shells that we can find. We're going to go shell hunting, James. Remember, you're not allowed to take anything that's, that's living in there. Well, you got to maybe. Oh, uh, I you meant the shells are alive. No, not the shells. They're, well, there's, so, there's always something in the shell, isn't there? Oh, I thought they meant like the shell was like alive. Like, oh, okay. You're joking again. No. You got to stop with these hilarious jokes, James. Exactly. You're living hilarious, oh, right? What is it, James? James thinks it's an alligator. Yeah. Oh my God! Look at him! Look at him! <laughs> <laughs> This reminds me of the one we used to look after next door. That's called We used to love the bu buttercups, always staring at me. I feel like he's ready to prounce or attack. Okay, let's leave him. Caution, rattlesnakes common on the island. Ollie, do you want me to No walking in here. Should we, go, should we go searching for them? No, Ollie. <laughs> right, just walk, yeah, just stay there. Oh my God, there's a rattlesnake. Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this place is beautiful. No, it's just scary. It's not scary. No, no, there's snakes. There's, there's nothing sharks. here. There's there's no, sharks. there's not. Dad there's a butterfly. There's a butterfly, and that's it. Dad read about large sharks. Look, we've seen a, tur a tortoise and a butterfly. That's it so far. But apparently they? they can charge. No, they won't. This is the only thing you need to watch out for: the cactus. You don't want to tread on that. This, everything's just scary. Everything's spiky for James. <laughs> oh, this beach. Look at the sand. Well, Look at that. that. The there won't be stingrays on the sands, it's lovely. Right, this is where we're setting up shop. This is where we're going. Right, who's coming in the sea first? James, you coming in, buddy? Come on. There are so many shells. Look at this. That's awesome. Right, let's test out the water. Let's see how cold the water is. Shuffle? shuffle? James, they're not going to be here. Shuffle. James, you don't shuffle here. There's not going to be shuffle. Shuffle. Is that one there? <laughs> Mate, there's not going to be stingrays here. I think there's stingrays like further out maybe. Are you shuffling? Shuffle? Oh, it's cold. James, there's not stingrays until you get further out, buddy. James, you're not going to tread on one here. You're not going to tread on... You're paying me £100. Ah! Okay, I'll pay you £100 because there's not going to be a stingray in this. They can't survive in this, James. They have to be out there. No, look, Dad's going straight out. No, the black thing's a seaweed. James, all you got to do is just skim your feet along. <laughs> you haven't even made it in the water yet. Just come on. You absolute wimp. This is beautiful, though. Like, 
Wow, this is so cool. I think I might try and like take a walk down there. It's like a mile down there and you get to the end of the island there and it's apparently just absolutely amazing. See, this isn't so bad, is it? No, because there's sharks as well, Oli. <laughs> you, I've never known someone to worry so much. I worry about stuff and I, oh, that was cold. Ah, oh, that was cold. Ah, 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 <laughs> Here's a shell. Hold on. Look at that. Oh yeah, we're shell hunting. No, James, there's nothing in it. It's fine, there's nothing in the shell. Mum is gonna have a field day doing this. Mum loves shell hunting. There's nothing I love more than uh, walking through the water on the beach. This is just beautiful. Such a nice day as well, like, we had like a storm the other day, now look what it's like. It's yeah. amazing, isn't it? But one thing I must say, there are so many shells on this beach, like if you wanna, if you're interested in picking up shells and shell picking, then you should come here. Or if you just wanna like relax in the gorgeous weather on the beach. Right here, right? <laughs> yeah, go there. James, <laughs> James is, <laughs> James is hot. <awesome. laughs> what are you doing? Uh, it's <laughs> no, no, he doesn't, I, I he doesn't want to go right I, in. I sat down and I felt a rock and I was like, <laughs> Right, so we're going to try and see how far we can walk around there, but I think it's going to be too long because it takes about an hour. Whoa, look at that. That's a big old shell. Right, I've been walking for probably about half an hour now. We can't even see really where we were. It was, it's all over there and we're actually a lot closer to this island. Are we going to make it? Probably we're going to get there? Yeah, we're going to make it. We're going to get there. That's our challenge. Look at these birds, how quickly they move their feet. <laughs> It's like scurrying the army of birds trying to all find crabs. Oh my god, we've arrived in Bird City. There's birds everywhere. The land of the birds. I oh know these ones are bathing right now. These ones are just chilling. We've got more over there. They literally are an army or something. I know, they're everywhere, aren't they? All right, we've been walking for about an hour now and we're still not over here. And we're so far away. So really? we might start to turn back in a minute, right? Yeah. Because We're uh much halfway back to the ferry start. Yeah, I know. Wow, look at this shell we just found. Look at that. That's incredible. It's such a shame it's broken though. I just spotted some dolphins. They're right out here. Let's see if they come up again. They were swimming that way. Look, can you see? Look, 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 look over there. Can you see? Can you see them? Yeah. Yeah, there they are. Go, okay, I'm not going in that water now. <laughs> I feel like they're sharks. Oh look, they're dolphins. No, Goodbye no. beach, you were great. No stingrays, but we saw I mean, dolphins. Yeah. Saw a tortoise. And there's a stingray by my foot in, in the sea. Yeah, James says there's a stingray by his foot his in the tail. sea. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I don't believe like, that. There's sharks, there's sharks in our <laughs> Oh, I'm not gonna lie, right? I was just sitting down, minding my own business, and you know, having a bit of sunbathe, and James was shuffling very, very slowly into the water. And there was all of a sudden these two fins that just came out of the water, and I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And then I was like, oh no, they're dolphins, because they were like swimming up and under. Yeah, I could have uh, ended up freaking out the whole beach for no reason. Oh, there is literally nothing worse than sandy feet. Sandy feet. Oh, wet sandy feet, even worse. Right, it's that time again for some food. Woo! We love our food here in America. We had a little bit of an issue, okay? So we were driving the car dad was being very very careful and steady with it like on a serious note he was because we haven't gone above 40 miles an hour yet and throughout the whole time that we've had it there's been this like bleeping noise about there being a problem with the battery so we, we phoned them up we were like look there's this battery problem whatever oh my god look at that sunset damn James look at that it's all right, it's all right, it's probably more than all right. It's a flipping it's cool sunset. Sun it's a, no, it's a cool sunset. But it's way more important than my story right now. My goodness, look at that. Right, continuing with the story, basically we phoned up and was like, look, the car is showing this warning sign. And they were like, well, it's had it. <laughs> There's an issue with it and someone's had to come and pick it up. So we're on foot today. We're walking for seven miles no, to the restaurant. Ten minutes seven, miles. seven miles. It's Guys, miles. James is moody because he's hungry. He's hangry. A hangry boy, aren't you? Don't take it out on me though, please. I'm only trying to help you. You're not really you're lying. I am trying to help you. I am you're being very moody. We could use that as a car. We could use those fun rides. No, we're not using that green thing we as a ride. Food. No. Have, what about well, oh my god, there's loads of them. Dad! We can use one of those cars tomorrow then, can't we? One of the pink and green ones. That's a good idea, what about James. A segway, the segway as well. It's a good idea. I don't think a segue would be the best. Okay, this is cool. This is cool. No, it's more than alright. It's better than alright. 
It's better than all right. This is so cool. Are you enjoying this pier, James? <laughs> he just wants food, but uh, we are, we're enjoying ourselves. It's good, there's like markets, lots of people like selling different things. Look, you can get a ring with your name on it. A phone case with your name on it, maybe. Oh, you've already got a phone case. Uh, a necklace. Oh, a necklace. Another necklace. What do you mean necklaces is for girls? I've got a necklace. I've got well, my girl. My girl, because I've got a necklace. No, I'm not. Pier 60 is absolutely buzzing right now. We've got guys jamming. This beach is honestly incredible. The sand is so white, it's amazing. And when you get sunsets like that, you can't really beat that, can you? Not to mention as well, how many people are actually on the beach? Like all of those people down there, all of those people all the way down there. It's mental. Oh my God, this bird's doing photo shoots. Are you kidding me? <laughs> photo shoot with a bird, $5. Oh my God. Really big bird. I wouldn't want that to go near me. Beware the lionfish. Now, James, if you get stung by that, look, you get temporarily paralysis, dizziness, blistering swelling. You don't want to be stung or get step on one of them. And that's a fish. How are you supposed to do all this medical stuff if you get paralyzed? <laughs> How are you supposed to find some hot water if you're just on the floor and you can't move? Well, I think it's about like if other people, like it's to inform everyone. Oh. Smarty pants. Mum is on the Instagram today. She is Jeez. going for the photos. Yeah, My word. Top photographer. Top photographer Sal. No, 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 no. My word, look at that. Mm. Right, I want to get some photos now. I've got to get some photos before this sun goes down because that is nearly going down. Well, this is what everyone's here to see. The sun going down. Hey, buddy! Oh God! He's gonna. Oh, he knows. He's getting some food. Oh no! It's down there. It's on the floor. He's trying to look for it. You're too big of a beak. Can't see. Back in the day, everyone would just, you know, enjoy the sunset. Now we've got photo shoots, photo shoots, photo shoots. Just everyone is on their phone taking a photo of the sunset. And on the other side, we've got more photo shoots, selfies, and loads more photos. Okay, we have just arrived at Frenchie's Rockaway Grill, and this place is lively, I must say. It's right on the beach, right here, and already there is a party going on inside. Apparently they've got some like incredible cocktails here, so I'm gonna be trying that out, and also we've been recommended the grouper sandwich, which is a type of fish that is very, very popular here, and apparently it tastes absolutely perfect. So uh, I think we're gonna be going for that tonight. Drinks, 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 so many to choose from. Apparently they have this like cocktail challenge, which you might have to take part in. See you off, see you off, see you off. Oh, Sally's already finished one drink, she's on her second. We've gone for a bit of vodka lemonade tonight, I think. We had a, I had a cocktail a minute ago, which was like a mixture of like about five different, was it rums? I think it was uh, five different rums or so, which was lovely. I'm very excited about food there. I've gone for a group of sandwich, the one that they recommend going for when you come here. Oh, it's positive grouper. We've got a grouper. Right here. Oh wow, that looks good. You got a mean old hot dog right there. Mum, the grouper as well, and and the grouper. We're the grouper crew. Grouper crew and a uh, big old hot dog for James. Good morning people, how's it going? It's the next day now, but these two vlogs are combined together. Today is our last full day. Last full day here in Florida, which is a shame because we've had such an amazing time. Now we are off to a marine aquarium and it's a rehabilitation center for animals that struggle in the wildlife. Either they've got a... Uh, 
some kind of disability or they can't survive on their own. So this place helps them out, it sorts them, and then hopefully will put them into the wild once they've recovered and they're a lot better. Dad's admiring the birds. Beautiful. It is a, it's a pretty beautiful bird. It's got a tag on it. Yeah. It's been a tagged bird. Oh God, his boyfriend is coming over. He's going to start a fight. Right, we'll let you be. So at this aquarium, the rehabilitation centre, they actually film, film dolphin tail here. And this was uh, one of the tails that I think they used in the movie. There we are. There's a little clip from the movie. Him dancing with a dolphin with its tail. We just got him yesterday. His name is oh. Nacho. Oh. What's wrong with Nacho? So Nacho was found floating and they're not exactly sure what was wrong with her. We cleaned her up already but she was covered in barnacles and algae. Oh, no. so. so what they actually do here, they're a rehabilitation centre and they look after sick animals which then they hopefully then release them into the wild if they're fit enough for yeah. it. And that sea turtle there that has a, a bit of an illness, it's got something wrong with its stomach and it's got barnacles all over it. So what they're going to do is they're going to really try and um, help help it uh, the best it can and then if it if it goes to stage two which is here they'll put it into one of these water containers which then hopefully they'll release into the wild so Mike and Echo they're going out on Tuesday though yep. Mike and Echo so what was what was wrong with them this one had pap tumors Mike Echo had Pap tumors as well. So pap tumors is the one that they're getting. Yeah. Oh, she's coming to say hello. This is Marigold. Look in the corner. Over there. Look in the corner. See? Look. Oh. Why she going to And what was wrong with her? Was it tumors again? No. So maybe not a crazy turtle. So she didn't have the Oh, okay. Nicholas is swimming around. There he is. So do you see his um? scars on the back of his yeah. body. He was rescued in 2002. He was found on the beach with his mom, Noel, and it was on uh, Christmas Eve. That's why he's named Nicholas after St. Nicholas. Um, and they were stranded for a few oh, hours. Wow. So they had some pretty severe sunburns on their back. And Noel, unfortunately, his mom passed away the day after she got here. So what happened was is that the mom, if she is sick, she will strand herself. And baby, of course, they stay with their, their moms until they're about six or seven years old. So Nick stranded himself as well. So, so there were sunburns on the back of it? Yeah. Wow. Because they were stranded for so long. Must be long. so painful. So yeah, he had third degree sunburns. Ten feet long? Yes. A leather back sea turtle, my yeah. word. Happy wow. Day. I don't know if you guys know that. Happy National Dolphin Day. Yeah. <laughs> there, look at that. Wow. I'm not gonna lie, if I saw that in the ocean, I would be petrified. <laughs> right, go on, James, jump in there. Sharks. They're not sharks. Yeah? Look, the baby sharks. So, oh, down there. Down there. They, Is that a piranha? I don't think so. What are these fish here? Those are redfish. Redfish. Yes, and those are giant things. Yeah, they are massive. Yeah. <laughs> they are big fish. They don't have any predators in this habitat. Yeah. Obviously, they have a lot of room to grow. But... The sharks down here. Yeah. That massive thing oh. lying on the ground. There where the sharks are. Right, go on, jump in. James, don't, 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 don't. You wouldn't anyway, you'd freak out. Well, it's bigger than you, so of course it would. Look, it'd be scared No, it wouldn't. I could just jump on top of No, the but there's two of them and one of you. So it'd be like, right, hold on a minute. No, 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 but they'll be like, hold on a minute, there's, there's some food to be taken here, so they'd definitely get you. Sea turtle. <laughs> Sea disorder. Yeah, like That's why his bum's in the air. He can't. He can't buoyant right. Oh, that's so sad. Oh my word! Look at the pelicans. This guy's snoozing. This guy's keeping an eye out for us. This poor turtle here, he's blind. He can't see at all. So they have to actually go down on this ladder and, and hand feed him. It's an otter. What's his name? Wally. Wally. Oh, wow. So what was wrong with Wally? So Wally, um, also has a unique dragon story. He was, there was a, a man that lived on a houseboat. And right. he found this baby otter kit. And when they're babies, they are the cutest thing you've ever seen. And yeah. They're really sweet and they're playful. And he decided he wanted to keep it as a pet. Now, once otters become a little bit older, they become territorial. They're not as sweet and nice. You don't really want to get near them. One of the main issues is that people want these animals as Pet. They were saying about earlier one of the sharks. This guy bought it because he, he bought it for his like little aquarium and didn't realize that it was going to grow much more. And you, I mean, you see it, it's like a meter, if not more, more, more than a meter long. It's the same 
with the otter, buy it when there's smaller thing. Oh yeah, it'll be great for a pet, and it's like it's a wild animal. You can't you can't keep it as a pet. So if you're thinking of buying an otter or a shark, don't. So it's it's fins damage then. Oh, so so is that is that she, is she based on the movie then? Yep. Oh wow. She played the oh, she was in the movie. Yeah. Oh my word! Wow. Yeah, the movie, so she yeah. doesn't actually need the tail then to be able to swim. No, she just uses it for physical therapy. Ah, so I see. See, oh there, it's right up there above her. Oh yeah, there. She was in dolphin tail too. Wow, that's just incredible, isn't it? That is incredible. I can't believe that. Yeah. Lost her tail and teaches herself to swim. So she swims side to side like a shark then you said? Yep. That is crazy. <laughs> it's getting everyone soaked. Got more than a splash zone. My god, everyone's... What? We're literally just far back. I know, just far back. But thankfully we weren't sitting right at the front, were we? you guys read the small little signs that say you're in a splash zone. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's a pretty powerful animal. <laughs> but they are traveling for that food. And then when they find it, they have to catch it. So here, we ask them to exercise. So we're going to start in that back pool. Take a look, guys. Now Nicholas is currently learning a continuous back dive. So those back dives that you see him do, he usually knows it as a one and done behavior. But what Brooke is uh, communicating to him is that we would like you to continue uh, doing a back dive until you hear that whistle. So let's take a look. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, look at these stingray. So we can actually stroke the string stingray with two fingers. James? No, I'm not touching. Mate, you got to touch it. Look, two fingers look like this. It's Come here. Bite no, it, bite mate, they don't bite. They don't bite. Look. Ready? Oh. No, look, they've just got a spiky tail. Look. But you look, you just put two fingers. Oh, look, look at this guy. Look, 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 look. <laughs> they, go, they go right to the bottom so no one can touch them. <laughs> They're used to it now. Go on, put your hand in. <laughs> James thinks that stingrays will eat him. This one's gentle. Look. Mate, the sharp bit is that you see that barb on the end of its tail. You see right at the back of its head. yeah, but it will stick it out and it will stick it in you if you tread if if like you trod it. What? Like a bee. A bee? Yeah. Like almost like a yeah, like a bee. It's got a, like a stinger. Well, that was amazing. It was so nice to see like all the work that they do for the animals, looking after them, taking care of them, and then you know putting them out if they're if they're fit for the wildlife. What was your favourite? I like the otter. The what? The, the otter? otter? The otter or the otter? The otter. The otter. What's he's an otter? otter? He's, he's otter. Is he ot? Is you what? Is you what? Is you? Oh, he's using an otter in it. An otter. Otter. Well done, James. Like you can talk properly. Water, um, my favourite was obviously the dolphins and the uh, the sea turtles as well. They're amazing. If you guys ever get the chance to go to Clearwater Marine Aquarium, then I'd go. It's a really really cool experience, and you see the amazing work that they do. And most of the people there are they're actually volunteers as well. So well done, you guys. Wow, James has got to sit on the floor to do his lace up. Do you want me to do it for you, James? Do you know how to do your lace up? Do you know how to do it up? Come on, James. You know how to do your own shoelace. What do you mean it's stuck in a knot? What knot? Oh my god, what is wrong with you? Leave the money alone. <laughs> We're at this uh, bar and there's just like money, one dollar bills, plastered literally everywhere, all inside, everything. <laughs> well, these birds, they could literally just steal that fish right there. Okay, now we're gonna be going on this uh, this boat tour over here to actually try and find some wildlife dolphins. And so that everyone knows each other's names, I've got my, my name there. I've actually got, you know, 
obviously the Ollie logo, whatever, but you know, otherwise people might call me Ollie Ollie. Uh, we've got James, Andrew, and Sally. <laughs> Great idea. You're Andrew. Good old boy, Andrew. Patrick. I feel like we're like in Magaluf on like a party boat or something. We're about to go for it. Look, the, the, bar, the bar's up here. Dad's about to go for it. My God. Oh my god, this boat's a shark. <laughs> I think they're loving the boat journey, bloody hell. We haven't seen any dolphins yet though. Whoa, look at them. Wow. Whoa, there's loads of them. Very, very small things. That is because those are baby dolphins right there, guys. Those are calves. Oh. This is called a nursery pod, which is a group of females coming together to raise these a village motto. Wow. So cool to see them in the wild. Right in front of the boat, guys. So cool.